tens of thousands. But, my lord, there is no such force. There's a running joke that Shermans are by far the most common type of tank in War Thunder, and this solidifies that. This is the Swedish Sherman 3-4, and its addition means that every single tech tree in the game has at least one Sherman. Shermans are always great to play, so let's take it out and have some fun. But before we get started, a quick word from this video's sponsor, Raycon. If you somehow haven't heard about Raycon at this point, basically their goal is to provide quality and inexpensive wireless earbuds, which is something pretty lacking in the industry. Sure, you can find some pretty cheap earbuds out there, but they more often than not sound like a tin can. When it comes to Raycon, not only are they half the price of some competitors, their earbuds are developed entirely in-house. They aren't made by some random OEM. Their engineers have previous experience working at top brands like Bose, so you can rest assured knowing these guys know what they're doing. I often use them when I'm doing random stuff around the house. I'm not usually a fan of in-ear earbuds, but the gel tips are pretty comfortable. Their battery life is great at up to 8 hours, and the carrying case had its capacity bumped all the way up to 32 hours. That's a pretty big improvement over the previous 24. Messing around with the awareness mode not only hammered home how good that feature is, but how good they are at noise isolation. Turning on awareness mode is genuinely like taking earplugs out. To reduce the cost even more, you can click the link in the description, or go to buyraycon.com slash spookston, which will get you 15% off your order. Thanks again to Raycon for sponsoring this video, and let's get back to it. Hey buddy, T34, you might wanna, you might wanna look this way. Oh wait, there's a bad guy down there. Uh, that's highly unfortunate. I'm coming to kill you! Quack. I don't know <laughs> what that guy was doing. I thought I was 120% dead. See ya. I figured, you know, I'm probably gonna die here. I might as well kill one of them. Nope. I got both of them. Oh. Yeah, I would not have tried to reverse if I knew that was a stug. What? <laughs> Are you having some difficulties navigating? Ow, that like deafened me. What? What happened? I know I got shot, but... Wait, was he firing HFAP? He probably would have killed me if he wasn't. There we go. Uh, Suddenly I don't want to be here anymore. I feel like I've... Okay, yeah, I've definitely overextended. Can I see that guy? I can indeed. Uh, damn. There we go. Is this Stug still here? He went back to the same spot. <laughs> you can see his corpse. Actually, I just looked, and that's an entirely separate guy. So we just have two Stug players that love that particular bush spot. Man, I don't think, uh, I don't think deploying smoke in that position is gonna do much to help you. Oh god, is that a Yak Panzer? It is! <laughs> I am getting out of here. I did not know we could fight that. Get him, T-34. I believe in you. Look, he's right there. Oh, he's just gonna keep on rolling, huh? I mean... Okay. I was making that out to be a big deal. I didn't know he was on the dented cranium side of things. I was gonna say I should maybe bring more ammo, but I forgot this is not like the jumbo. It does put ammo in that one side, unfortunately. Wait, are you... <laughs> what are you being a mountain goat for, man? Your team is losing. You don't have a single cap. I feel like your priorities should be just a little bit different. There should be another guy over here somewhere. Oh, there he is. Yep. <laughs> bye bye In lieu of taking more ammo, I think I should just, you know, actually aim. I got 15 kills. In case it's not obvious, 75 Shermans are my all-time favorite type of vehicle in this game. Like, I think I can do pretty well in any vehicle you put me in. Well, almost any vehicle, but 
You put me in a 75 Sherman. Shaking my head. Things might go a bit differently now that Germany is on our team. That's not like a Germany's dumb thing. That's just a I know how to fight German tanks best thing. Did he try to smoke me? <laughs> I mean, it worked, but not in saving him. Hiya, friend. Have I ever mentioned that I love third-personing shots? Okay, let's see what we can do over here. Uh, what, what is this? Oh, it's a Sherman of some variety. Okay, now he's definitely done. Uh, there we go. I was gonna say, I'm trying to take out his barrel because Shermans actually do scare me when I'm also in a Sherman, but apparently our round did not do anything to his barrel, so. Ow. I did not hear that guy at all. Question is, am I going to waltz in front of the enemy if I go this way? Mmm. Well, I'm not dead yet, so. Uh-oh. I don't know where that came from. I'm panicking. <laughs> fight or flight, and I choose flight. I really hope my Artie gets him. Okay, yeah, that didn't do a single thing. I mean, that's typical War Thunder Artie, right? When you want it to do something, it never does, but you throw it in some random spot on the map and it gets like three kills. It does not appear that he's paying attention this way. Oh, maybe he was. Whoa! That was a headshot! We headshot his pilot with the 75. I'm gonna lose my voice at this rate. Oh, the Sherman is such a good tank. I don't understand how anyone could hate this. I really don't. Uh, hi? Yeah, I wouldn't try to reverse. That was not the best thing to do. Shermans are certainly not known for their reverse speed. I'll say that much. Do I hear a Calliope? I really need to take care of this thing, though. Um... Unfortunate. Did he notice where he got shot from? I don't think he did. Uh... There we go. Where's the Calliope at? I see ya! Wait. Oh, it's not a Calliope. I forgot I don't have a 50 cal. I can't tell if these guys over here need help, but they're gonna get it anyway. Now, uh, mm, maybe I shouldn't dive off the cliff. I feel like probably 80% of the time that I do, I just end up flipping. I do not want to do that right now. Maybe if it was the end of the match, then it'd be funny, but not right now. Uh, there we go. I think this is a full up here. The Firefly kind of clued me into that. I think advancing might be sort of a bad idea. I'm going to go back this way. Uh, if I don't get stuck, which I appear to be. Can I just machine gun you to death? Yes, I could have. I wasted around for no real reason. There we go. I was hoping I could just machine gun that and then kill the crocodile, but it worked out in the end. Let's see if we can do the funny. Nope. There we go. Yeah, I tried to show off. Um, that's another Firefly. I probably don't need the range find that, but... Not good. Not good. Yeah, I don't feel entirely confident in my ability to uh, hit his driver hatch thing. Twelve seconds later. There we go. I should have trusted myself. Oh, is there another one? Okay, it's just a regular one, but still, I don't feel too great about that. Managed to hit his barrel, somehow. Uh. Hmm. Okay, yep, it's busted now. And there we go. It just occurred to me that I am almost out of ammo. I aim to please, but my aim ain't too good. Uh, that doesn't sound friendly. I gotta move, I think. 
I could be paranoid right now, but I don't trust that one bit. Yeah, good thing I didn't trust it. Another Chaffee. Hi. Bye. It's not just me that feels bad whenever they kill a Chaffee, right? It's not like it's a sad or bad vehicle, it's just so cute looking. This guy should just keep on rolling, I think, so... I'm gonna let him do that, and then shoot him in the side of the head. Like that. There we go. Oh goodness. We are getting quite low on ammo. Thank god I hit his barrel. <laughs> It looked like he was gonna miss anyway, but yeah. I don't understand. We have almost our entire team. They're down to probably half, and we are still losing. Okay, I think 15 rounds should be plenty. If they just take B, we should be okay. I'm going to stay here and hold C, I believe. Okay, he's mostly taken care of. There you go. I don't think this guy should be able to do much... We should just be able to, uh... How did that not <laughs> track him at all? Uh... There we go, that works. The building also exploding made that look a bit more gratuitous than it actually was. Please don't bomb. Please don't bomb the cap, thank you. I'm not entirely sure I used gratuitous correctly there. Ooh, hello. Uh... Thank you for dying swiftly. Now we just flip it around and go this way. So another one down. Ooh, we kind of whiff that one. Ooh, got his breach. I didn't know we could actually do that. There we go. The old jumbo weak spot. I really hate the T-34's mantlet. Have I ever mentioned that? That... really... Keep him from moving, at least. I wonder if we can hit his MG port? Yeah, that worked. I mean, sure, man. Okay, it appears it's not going to work a second time, unfortunately. There we go. That was way dumber than it needed to be, but this is me we're talking about. Please, just no one die and respawn, I beg. What are you waiting for? Just tick down! Tick? Yes! Oh my goodness, dude. That was such a clutch. Man, I have got to stop watching YouTube shorts in between matches. I think it's genuinely, like, giving me a brain worm. All I get are videos about paramedics, welding, and really low effort war aesthetic videos, like, no effort whatsoever. I don't know why it keeps recommending them to me, because I skip right past them, they're all the same. <laughs> See ya. Yeah, it would be wise to reverse. Unfortunately, Britain didn't know what a reverse gear was until, like, 1980, so... Well. Well. Yeah, I wouldn't try to, uh, finagle that, man. Oh. Other Shermans do scare me quite a lot. That was really ill-advised, man. I would really like to take care of this SU, but... He is more intelligent than he seems, it would appear. Never mind, he just fired directly into the wall. I am wasting my ammo quite significantly. Please, just let me shoot this guy there. And there. Yeah, the good thing is I also know exactly where to shoot other Shermans. And then we just do a little bit of this. And a little bit of... This. I am very quickly running out of ammo yet again. 
I swear I'm just cursed because anytime I compliment someone, they usually do exactly the opposite of what the compliment was, like, five seconds later. Oh, Stuart. Uh, please don't shoot my engine. Thank you. We've been playing very defensively. I think it's time we go on the offense. Bop. It can't just be him, right? No, it's not. Um... Yeah, I wanted to see if I could ricochet it, and I kinda did, but not really. It didn't hit anything important. I'm at the point where I'm trying to do, like, Halo 3 sniper ricochet trick shots. Wait! How are they taking A? Uh-oh, there's a T-34 right there. Uh, please don't notice me. He did. He did notice. That could have been much, much worse. Honestly, considering that was a Russian APHE shell, I'm shocked it only killed one guy. I mean, it doesn't hurt to make sure, I suppose. So yeah, that's the Swedish Sherman 3-4. It's pretty much what you would expect from a Sherman, minus the 50 cal. The gun can be a bit difficult to get used to, but once you know where to aim, it's pretty amazing. It doesn't have much pen, but it has pretty much everything else. Anyway, if you guys have suggestions for video topics, leave them in the comments, and I'll see you on the next one.